To be sure, Neuschwanstein Castle is a unique project. After all, it's one of the most famous landmarks anywhere in Germany. So being asked to put up scaffolding on a building like this one and conduct project planning is definitely a one-of-a-kind challenge. It always gives me a thrill knowing that there's an expert technician on site, that the products are working well, and then to run into satisfied customers. How's it going? Good. They're just now putting up the roof construction. Three supports are already up. They're putting in the reinforcement now. I see. Let's have a look upstairs. Here you already have a good view of the shoring towers with our SRU steel whaler. Excellent. Good job. Yeah. The challenge was that we were not allowed to erect our scaffolding on the roof here, so we had to set it up on the four load-bearing towers. The assignment at Neuschwanstein Castle involved reducing the snow load on the weather roof. A roof surface of about 230 square meters. We had to get on top of the roof itself to connect the roof girders. It was not possible to pre-assemble them on site because there wasn't enough room to set up a crane here. And of course, we had to provide optimal protection for all visitors as well as all workers for the entire duration of the renovation project without interrupting the flow of visitor traffic at all. The geometry of the architecture is very unusual at Neuschwanstein, and every surface needed to be precisely surrounded. It took nearly 1,200 parts, 64 tons of equipment. Thanks to our modular components, we were able to adapt perfectly to all of the facade surfaces. Because the facade geometry was so complex, we opted to use the Perry up flick system. That enabled us to adapt to any shape using a 25 centimeter frame. The entire scaffolding construction can be set up using modular components, so we didn't need any custom parts at all. As a Perry employee, you get to work on some truly fascinating buildings. It's amazing what you get to see. This is the window where the Bavarian King Ludwig II would have looked out over his construction site, and we can climb to the same vantage point and look out on our scaffolding system and the entire construction site. That's really special.